Hi folks, Ken Ring of www.predictweather.com It's the 19th of June and the moon is in Virgo but it's crossing into Libra tonight and making its way to the southernmost point which is Capricorn uh, which is there and so it moves around uh, changes signs every two days and it'll be there on Friday and that'll be the furthest point overhead down here in the southern hemisphere but at the moment it's a windy time because it's just crossed the equator and there have been a whole spate of tornadoes across the US uh, as a result because the whole world moves under the moon in 24 hours and in New Zealand it's getting windier on the water anybody who's going fishing today because it's a good fishing day today uh, better watch out when they get too far out uh, it's a bit choppy out there and uh, that'll last a couple of days as we said yesterday we're coming up to the winter solstice on Tuesday the 22nd for the southern hemisphere and on the solstice there are less daylight hours uh, and um, because it's the longest day and therefore there's less opportunity for the sun to shine which means more chance of cold which means you get more cloud formation and greater chances of rain uh, in New Zealand we have fronts coming down from the north with nor uh, winds from the north and it's no coincidence that the moon's also coming down from the north moving south also and the weather systems that come from the north are longer lasting they're wetter, slower to develop and they're not wind driven by the, uh, like the southwesterly systems that blow from the west and um, southwest and bring more intermittent showers because the wind blows a lot of it away uh, when it comes from the from the north uh, you can expect heavier weather in some parts of the country uh, over the next few days but you can also expect um, because it's wind it's moon driven it's more of a, like a solid rain system so uh, that's what we're in for for the next couple of days uh, down here in New Zealand Thanks for watching. Hope I see you tomorrow.